Welcome to FedEx Field, Landover, Maryland, where the fans welcome their Washington Commanders. What's going on out there, YouTube? You came back. You came back, YouTube. What's up, YouTube? It's your man, Hollywood Sports. Guys, we are still in our franchise mode, man, and uh, we're still in week six. We're still discussing what we did to Atlanta in week six. So let's go over the stats. You guys seen some replays on how well we're playing right now. Uh, we're, we're just playing some good football. We're getting good blocking by the offensive line. The, the wide receivers are blocking. Our, our, our running backs are having some fun running through these holes right now. Doug Wims, our, our quarterback, is throwing some ropes. Man, we're... We're playing good on special teams, offense, and defense, all three phases. But let's look at the numbers right now. Offensive yards game, guys. Offensive yards, we had 149 yards. I'll take that any day of the week. We're only playing four-minute quarters, man. And they get we held them to 59 yards, man. Offensive yards, man. 59. We shut that offense down, baby. Looking at the offensive rush yards, we had 62 yards on the ground. I'll take it. We held them down to 19 yards on the ground. We get to the offensive pass yards. We had 87 yards through the air. Like I told y'all, man, Doug Williams was throwing some ropes. Our wide receivers were getting separation, man. It was just great. If you missed that game, man, go back and watch it, guys. Go back and watch that game. It was a fantastic game, man. All right, first offensive first downs, we had nine. They only had two. Again, our defense came to play. And you got to remember, guys, we were on the road, baby. We were on the road, but we took it. We took care of that. That that We didn't let them get that home field advantage. We got the momentum right out of the gate, man. From, from, the, first, from the first quarter to the fourth quarter, they never had momentum in this game. We really came out and came on this road to get, get make some noise, man. Punt return yards, we had 16. Kick return yards, we had 25. I'll take it any day of the week. Total yards game was 190 versus their 76. We kept them under 100 yards, man. We had one, we got one turnover from them. What was it? Uh, we got one turnover. Um, I don't remember what happened. Actually, I don't remember any turnovers, really. Oh, I know, guys. We threw an interception. We had the turnover. We threw an interception. Yeah, we threw an interception. Okay, third down conversions. We had four third down conversions. Um, they only had one. Again, that defense, we our defense played great. No fourth down, no two-point conversions. Red zone offense percentage. We got 100% in the red zone, man. And why is it 100%? Because we scored that seven points. I'm telling you guys, I think we could have get... I'm slowly... Getting the offense going. I'm opening the playbook up a little bit more, not being so cautious. We got some good plays in there. I may play all out in the next game, really to see what this offense can do. We know what the defense can do, man. They're, they're coming to play on every game. The defense hasn't let us down yet. All right. Um, and when we lost that one game, it was it was the offensive fault. Red zone. Um, again, we were we got that one touchdown in the red zone. No penalty yards right there. Time of possession. We Again, we win time of possession. Okay? We want to control time of possession. We want to control uh, field position battles. We want short fields instead of long fields. And we want them on long fields instead of short fields. All right? That's the way we do it, baby. That's the way we do it. Again, guys, I just wanted to share those stats with you. All right? Um, looking at, let's look at some player stats for a second here. Um, let's just look at... Uh, Doug Williams, I told y'all he was throwing ropes, man. He threw for 87 yards, one touchdown. And he threw that one interception. That was our one turnover. He threw one for 24 yards, man. Um, no sacks, seven completions. He threw. He got seven out of nine, guys. 77, 77% completion rate, man. Desmond Ritter, man, uh, he had one for 18. That was a great play by them. Uh, but, yeah, guys, uh... He was only three for five. Um, they did a lot of running, though. They, it's almost like they tried to establish the run. I don't know if because we were in a great defense of sets and they didn't want to throw the ball. I don't know, man. All right. Um, let's look at rushing. John Riggins had 90 tenths of 46 yards. He averaged 5.1 yards a game. We were pretty balanced between run and pass. I like that, but I think I'm going to open this offense up. We got the quarterback. We got the receivers. The offensive line does a great job pass blocking. I think I'm going to open this thing up on the next game. 
um, but we got to be careful. Um, so yeah, he had one long run of 13 yards. John Riggins, Joe Washington, he also contributed by his, the backup. He had four carries for 21 yards. He averaged 5.3. Again, I told y'all, man, this offensive line has been blocking. Let me move over here. Offensive line's been getting down, guys. I'm, I'm telling you, man, they've been getting down. All right. Um, any, anything else we got here? Um, B. John Robinson. Um, he had five yard. He had five attempts for five yards. Only averaged one yard to carry. He only averaged one yard to carry. What does that tell you about the defense, baby? What does that tell you about the defense, baby? Let's go. Let's go. Receiving yards. Uh, Joe Washington, we, again, I told you, we throw to our backside of the backfield. He had one catch for 24 big yards, baby. Art Monk had a catch for 19. Uh, again, Doug Williams was throwing ropes, baby. He was throwing ropes. Uh, uh, tight end Jordan Reeves had two catches for 19 yards. Beautiful. Oh, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's see, Kyle Pitts. Um, now, Kyle Pitts, he had a reception. Now, he started out running the football pretty well on the first few plays but we we quickly shut that down baby so they, they were throwing to him um as receiving santana moss got our touchdown on the rpo throw where uh art monk makes a great block you guys probably already seen that video um if you're watching all the videos through the series and was a nine yard catch for a touchdown all right guys um let's see i don't we don't need to do blocking Defense, um, Larry Kubin had two solo tackles. Uh, Sean Taylor had two tackles. Sean Taylor, man, he saved the first down. He came up, he came up, man, and, and it was an open field tackle, and he, he, he got us to get the ball back, and Atlanta had a fourth and one. I thought he was going to get a touchdown, I mean, a first down, but Sean Taylor came in and saved that play, baby. He came in and saved that play. All right, uh, let's see who else we got on the defense here. All right, Quentin Lowry got two tackles. Daryl Grant had two assists. Dexter Manley had two assists. Now, Mel Kaufman is going to make the Pro Bowl. He was, it, man, I'm telling you, man, he was making plays out there, man. He only had two solo tackles, but he was making plays, guys. And he had that one play for a loss. He had one tackle for a loss. That was a big play in the backfield. This, this dude going to make the Pro Bowl, guys. He's going to make the Pro Bowl. Um, yeah, that's all we need to see as far as the stats, man. All right, what we're going to do right now is we're going to um, prices and confidence. We're going to see. Now, Gary Clark, if you saw the video before the game, he was complaining about not getting enough touches. We're going we're gonna to do another video probably as we play when we go to week seven um, we're gonna go to New York we're gonna see what his crisis was if he's satisfied it said discuss your frustration with player performance hopefully he's happy now okay because we did throw him the football he he he, he he's actually blocking pretty good did we throw him the football I don't want to go back and see but we'll discuss that we'll discuss that um, mad staff points but well, we got 33 so we will do that again let's go ahead and advance the week I'm trying to keep you guys updated on, the, on what's going on behind the scenes so you can get a better view of what we're going through as a team. See, we still got 10 more players to negotiate. I don't like that we have so many players during the season. All those guys turned down their first set of contracts. We got to renegotiate with these guys. Um, but you can see, guys, we got to go to New York. Two weeks in a row, we're on the road. We just left Atlanta, which is it's still on the East Coast, right? Still on the East Coast. Now we got to go back up north to New York. They're three and three. We're five and one. We're looking good. Now the Giants are in second place at three and three. Okay, let me move out of the way. The Giants are in second place at three and three. Again, the Cowboys lost again and the Eagles lost again. That is unusual. Okay, this is really unusual. Usually the Giants at the bottom. We're like maybe in third. They usually have the Eagles and the Cowboys up top. But hey, man, we playing some good ball. I'm not complaining. Trust me, I'm not complaining. All right, guys. So that's our next game against the New York Giants. Again, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you'll be notified when things go down. I'm Hollywood Sports. Thanks for watching. And I will see you on the next video.